Hey guys, welcome back to Bougie Doll Life. My name is Katrina and today we're gonna make an art piece to go on the side wall of the staircase of my dollhouse. So we're gonna be using a kit that I got from Target. So let's go ahead and get crafting. Okay guys, so to make our canvas, we're gonna be using the STMT, a Simply Trendy Modern Touch. This is their DIY Geo Canvas. I bought this for about 20 to $22 in Target, so let's go ahead and get started and see what's inside. Okay, so this is how it looks once you open it up. And it has all the tools that you need to do this project. You shouldn't need any outside tools, which is great and which is the main reason why I bought this. And plus, I love the shape of the canvas. So the canvas is this really cute hexagon shape. I believe it's a hexagon. If not, I will look up the shape and correct myself right there below so yeah so let's go ahead and get started so what else comes with this pack it also comes with one blank canvas two parts liquid resin one pack of tempered glass a brush for you to paint on the canvas and it also comes with some popsicle sticks glitter and a pair of gloves but i will be using my own gloves that i have that are black but you can use their gloves if you don't have any gloves that's in the kit and then it also comes with it also comes with these three metallic acrylic paints one is white pink and then this one is like a mint green it does say in the front mint green so let's go ahead and get started and then it also has an instruction book it says it's easy to follow but we will see so let's go ahead and get started Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is take the acrylic paint and we're going to go ahead and paint a geo type of design onto this canvas. So let's go ahead and start painting. That I wanted for this canvas was like a marble type of 3D look with the paint. So I'm just swirling the different pastel colors around and I really love how the colors come together. so this is how my canvas came out once I was done mixing all the colors I really love it I think it's super cute so before we move on to the next step it says that it needs to dry so I'm gonna give it time to dry about an hour and then we're gonna come back and go move on to the next steps okay guys so this is what the canvas is looking like so let me turn it this way because this is the way it looks facing me. So let me go ahead and add some resin. Now it said that you can add resin to the color and paint over where you paint it with the resin mixed with the color. But I don't really want to do that because I like the colors kind of pastel faded. I like this look. So I'm just going to go ahead and mix a little bit of the two part resin. And then I'm going to just glide it across the canvas with the mixing sticks these sticks are meant to be mixed with the resin and the color to mix it together and to mix the resin and i'm going to use it just to mix the resin and spread the resin across and then we're going to go ahead and add the tempered glass and the glitter so let's go ahead and decorate i'm also using a measuring cup that i tend to not use anymore like they say to use disposable cups so i'm just using this old measuring cup i have new ones so i'm just going to use this and keep this in the craft room for crafts so let's go ahead and get started
just mixing part A of the resin and then you're going to mix part B of the resin. You're going to mix it together and then you're just going to go ahead and pour it right on top of the canvas. It's very simple and it has a real nice consistency so it won't overflow. You, you could glide it however you like it and I love the fact that I have full control when I was spreading the resin across the canvas and I really liked how it came out. Okay, so now we're gonna add the tempered glass. So I'm just gonna open it on the side. I'm gonna put it into my hands since I have gloves on. Remember, this is a little sharp, so be careful if you do decide to do it the way that I'm doing it. And I'm just gonna sprinkle it where I want it to be. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and add some glitter. So it says that you can add resin on top of the actual stones for the sharp edges, but this is going on the wall in my dollhouse and I kinda like the 3D effect that the glass is giving the resin, so I'm going to leave it like this. So let's go ahead and add some glitter. Okay guys, so this is what I came up with. I think it's so pretty. So I'm gonna go ahead and let it dry overnight and then we're gonna go ahead and hang it up in the dollhouse tomorrow. Okay, 
So this is the final look of the canvas. I put it in the staircase because this is where I intended to put it in the first place because I take a lot of pictures from this angle in the dollhouse and I, I just love how that looks in the corner up there. It looks so beautiful to me and I absolutely love it. I will link it down below where I got it from. I got it from Target, but I find the link for Target if you can order online. I will put in the links down below so you can order it. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Bougie Doll Life. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.